What's up guys, you're watching Taz I Help. In this video, we're going to be unboxing the new iPod Touch 5th generation. Uh, this just came out the other day. It was announced at Apple's event a little while back ago along with the new iPhone 5. Uh, this new iPod Touch has a 4-inch display, uh, has a better camera, has the new A5 processor. Uh, so this iPod Touch should be uh, pretty nice. And it also comes in colors. If you can tell, I got the blue iPod Touch. Uh, so there is the box itself. Uh, I got the 32 gigabyte. It comes and 32 and 64 gigs and it starts out at 300 bucks but you could still uh, buy the iPod Touch 4th generation <clears throat> for 200 bucks uh, so I don't think I'm going to need the unboxing knife for this but I will set it aside just in case I uh, just got a little tab to pull here we're going to go ahead and unbox this one I think they have about 8 colors of the new iPod uh, in so uh, you can pick from multiple different choices of colors. Uh, I just wanted to pick this one because blue is my favorite color and I think it looked pretty sweet. All right, it wants me to just pop it out of here, I think. I don't want to break it. Sometimes these are really, really confusing. Okay, I think I have to peel this off first. There we go. Oh, there's a screen on it, duh. Or a fake screen on it. There we go. And there's the iPod itself. I'll set that to the side for now. Look at the new design and everything. Uh, so in here we've got, uh, of course, the little quick start guides. Uh, we've got the headphones, which actually, uh, let me make sure and confirm this, the ones with the iPod Touch are not supposed to have a headphone jack on, or not a headphone jack, but a uh, microphone, which apparently they don't. They don't have a switcher either. That's kind of weird that they didn't put like the little button uh, thing on there so you can change your songs on an iPod. That's kind of... Weird. So if you want the, the button changer and you want the Apple new Apple earpods with that, you're gonna have to go out and spend thirty bucks. Uh, here is the new like matching strap that they come that comes along with the new iPods. Uh, and there should be a little thing over here on the side, uh, right here, to put that through. I'm not sure exactly how that works, but I'll, I'll look at that in a little bit. So there's the strap with it, and then of course we've got the new USB cable, which looks kind of weird the way they packaged it. It's the new Lightning cable, not USB. I'm just going to rip it apart. So there we go. You don't get a uh, wall brick with that. You just get the uh, USB itself. Uh, it plugs right in there. So it does have the new lightning uh, adapter. Uh, headphone uh, jack on the bottom. Again, the new 4-inch display. I'm hitting my camera now. Uh, there is the back of it. It looks pretty nice. Uh, it doesn't really feel like the iPhone 5's back. Uh, it feels more like smooth kind of, or not really more smooth I guess, but I don't know, it just feels a little bit different to me. Uh, the new screen feels nice, but now that I'm used to my iPhone 5, uh, this doesn't feel that weird. It would probably feel really awkward. I've had an iPod Touch with a, a bigger screen uh, at first, but I'm used to my iPhone 5. I'll actually get my iPhone 5 out so we can kind of look at a comparison of them. Slide the rest of this stuff to the side. I'm going to unplug this lightning cable. Take a little first look at it. We don't need to set it up right now. So as you see, the iPod Touch is super, super thin. If you can tell right there, it is just absolutely thin. Just look at that. You can see it compared to my fingers. It is the thinnest iPod Touch they ever made. I can't believe that's that thin. Look at that. And it weighs, uh, it actually feels like it weighs more than the last iPod Touch. Um, I don't remember what they said about the weight of it, but it's nice. It's super thin. It's definitely a lot thinner than the iPhone 5. There's definitely a big difference there. Uh, it looks nice. I'm excited to play around with this. Of course, my review will be coming soon on this. Uh, and then uh, next, I'm going to be unboxing the iPod Nano, so stay tuned for that video. Uh, that's going to be coming soon also. And yeah, that's about it. Let me know what you guys think about the new iPod Touch 5th generation. Are you going to get it? Uh, have you already ordered yours? Are you planning to get it? Or now that you've seen this, do you want it? Let me know in the comments down below. Click the like button if you enjoyed this. It's down below. I really appreciate it. It helps out a lot. And I will see you guys in the next one. Also, make sure you subscribe for more videos. Peace.